Welcome to uh, First Assembly of God Church, located here at 1400 East 13th Street in Douglas, Arizona. Welcome everybody that's on Facebook and YouTube as well. Today's reading is going to be from Romans chapter 12, verses uh, 9 through 21. So let me get my public speaking legs under me. Uh, it's been a while. I taught high school for four years, and I talked taught, taught to classes of 30, 35 high school kids and uh, did it all day long and never had any nerves. A little nervous right now, but I'll get it back together again. Um, so all week when pa I, Pastor asked me to do this, I was kind of thinking, you know, uh, like putting a lesson plan together. What was I going to talk about? And uh, when I drive around in my truck all week at work, um, I have the ability to listen to scripture on my on my Bluetooth on my on my truck. So I was thinking uh, every time we do uh, our tithes and offerings, Pastor mentions that our our motto is "We love God and we love people." So I was thinking, what does that mean? We love people. So uh, I was thinking, as Gentiles, I went to Book of Romans and I put it on Bluetooth and I was listening to it. And I got the scripture, I think, that would uh, apply to what it means to love people. So uh, let me read that to you. Uh, love must be free of hypocrisy. Detest what is evil. Cling to what is good. Be devoted to one another in brotherly love. Give preference to one another in honor. Not lagging behind in diligence, fervent in spirit, serving the Lord. Rejoicing in hope. Persevering in tribulation, devoted to prayer. Contributing to the needs of the saints, practicing hospitality. Bless those who prosecute you, and bless and do not curse. Rejoice with those who rejoice, and weep with those who weep. Be of the same mind toward one another. Do not be haughty in mind, but associate with the lowly. Do not be wise in your own estimation. Never pay evil for evil to anyone. Respect what is right in the, in the sight of all people. If possible, so far as it depends on you, be at peace with all people. Never take your own revenge, beloved, but leave room for the wrath for, of God, for it is written, Vengeance is mine, I will repay, says the Lord. But if your enemy is hungry, feed him. If he is thirsty, give him drink. For in doing so, you will heap burning coals on his head. Do not, do not be overcome by evil, but overcome evil with good. So what I got from this, and I was talking to Pastor about this, and... Uh, Brother Doug, one time at, at uh, Wednesday Bible study, uh, since it's been about a year now that I've come back and I've really started to do my walk with, with Christ. And uh, the toughest thing that I've learned, it's easy to love people that love you. The tough part is to love people that don't like you or have actually done something bad to you. That's the tough part. That's the true mark of a Christian. Okay? So that's what I got from that. So uh, let us pray. Uh, keep, church, keep the church and Pastor Barajas in your prayer. Also, Brother Dagnino, he's traveling with his family. Gracious Heavenly Father, we pray that your Holy Spirit be here in this church, in this sanctuary of the Lord. We pray that you open the hearts and minds of the people that are here today to receive your message. Anoint the pastor, Lord, so his message is powerful. May it bring knowledge and wisdom and conviction, Lord. We pray that when we leave this service today, we share the message with believers and non-believers both. And we ask this to your Son, our Lord, Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you so much, Mark. God bless you, my brother. Thank you, Brother Mark. Wow, I tell you, that was, that was good. You didn't come across nervous at all. <laughs> and uh, Mark's come a long way, a long way from uh, when I first know him. I've just, I just see God working all all over his life in a beautiful way. And uh, that's that's what it's about. That's a seed that falls on good soil. It produces fruit and result. And uh, God's got great things for you, Brother Mark. Always does. Amen. Well, it's good to be in the house of the Lord. If you're glad to be here, give the Lord a big praise offering. Amen. Gonna invite you to stand and shake someone's hand if they're close to you, if they're far, wave at them, let them know you're with your smile that you're glad to see them in the house of the Lord. Praise the name of Jesus. 
give me a, just a pinch of monitor, if you will, on the acoustic, the floor monitor. Just a pinch. He is the king of kings. He is the Lord of lords. His name is Jesus, 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 Jesus. Oh, he is the king. He is the king. Of kings, he is the Lord of Lords. His name is Jesus, 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 Jesus. Oh, he is a king. Praise God, he is the king of kings. Hallelujah. We are just happy to be in the house of the Lord. Only King forever. Let's sing about it. Our God, a firm foundation, our rock, the only solid rock. As nations rise and fall, kingdoms once strong now shaken. We trust forever in Your name. The name of Jesus. The name of Jesus, you are the only king forever. Almighty God, we lift you higher. You are the only king forever, forevermore. You are victorious. Unmatched in all your wisdom, in love and justice, you will reign. Every knee will bow. We bring our expectations. Our hope is anchored in your name. The name of Jesus. We trust the name of Jesus. And you are the only King forever. Almighty God, we lift you higher. You are the only king forever, forevermore. You are victorious. We lift your banners high. We lift the name of Jesus. From age to age you reign. Your kingdom has no end. We lift our banners high. We lift the name of Jesus, from age to age you stand, your kingdom has no end, you are the only king forever, almighty God we lift you higher, you are the only king forever, forevermore, you are victorious, you are the only king forever. Almighty God, we lift you higher. You are the only King forever, forevermore. You are victorious. You are the only King forever. Almighty God, we lift you higher. You are the only King forever. You are victorious. We love God. We love people. It's also on our bracelet here that we are, uh, is that what it's called? Bracelet. I don't know. It sounds funny. Wristband. Wristband. And, uh, and so let's say it together. What is our motto? We love God. We love people. And that was a great scripture that you, you read on that, Mark. Let love be without hypocrisy. Amen. Very, very good. I tell you what, you could teach a class. I think you're ready. <laughs> that was that was to the point. Well, he is a teacher uh, at heart, so praise the Lord. We're going to do a couple of more songs before we get into the Word of God. I'm going to invite you to stand as we continue. Amen. Praise in the name of the Lord. Praise God. Let the King of my heart be the mountain where I run. The fountain I drink from, oh, he is my song. 
Let the king of my heart be the shadow where I hide, the ransom for my life. Oh, he is my song, for you are good, you are good. Yes, you are. You're good. Oh, let the king of my heart be the wind inside myself, the anchor in the waves. Oh, he is my song. Let the king of my heart be the fire inside my veins. The echo of my days, oh, he is my song. For you are good, you're good. Oh, yes, you are good. Yes, you are, Lord. You're so good. You're, oh, yes, you are. Let the King of my heart be the mountain where I run. The fountain I drink from, oh, he is my song. Let the king of my heart be the shadow where I hide. The ransom for my life, oh, he is my song. For you are good, you're good. You're good, oh, you are good, yes, you're good, oh, Lord, you are good, you're so good, oh, you're never gonna let, never gonna let me down. You're never gonna let, never gonna let me down. You're never gonna let, never gonna let me down. You're never gonna let, never gonna let me down. For you are good, you're good. good. You're so good, Lord. Oh, and you are good. Jesus, you're so good. You've been good to me, Lord. You are good. You're good. Oh. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. For all your blessings upon me. So undeserved. But you do out of your love for us. Thank you, God. Thank you, Lord. All hail in Jesus. the King of kings, He's the Lord of lords, He's the bright morning star, and throughout eternity, I'm going to praise Him. And forevermore I will reign with Him. The time is coming, I tell people, you know, sometimes people talk about death and they get so scared because it's the unknown. 
But this isn't the worst thing that can happen to us. This is not the most serious thing. The most serious thing is when we stand before God, are we ready? Are we ready to hear him say, well done, thou good and faithful servant? Are we ready to hear him say, yes, your name is written in the book of life, come on in. That's the most scary thing when people close their eyes on this earth and open them before God. And it's not going to be by our good efforts or our good works. The Bible clearly says that. For by grace are you saved through faith, and this not of yourself, but it is a gift of God. And then it says a very clear Ephesians chapter 2, not by works, so anyone can boast. No. It's out of the love of God and the grace of God that he saves. And he saves from the the, the person that everything, one thinks is good, but is still lost, to the person that is the worst sinner in the world. The love of God. And then when we're with him, to sing, to praise him forever, like this song says. Oh, hell, King Jesus, and all hell, Emmanuel. What a day that'll be. He's the King of kings. He's the Lord of Lords. He's the bright morning star. Oh, hallelujah. And throughout eternity, I'm going to praise Him. Oh, and for What a day that's going to be. Amen. What a day. No wonder Mercy Me wrote that song that it was a Christian song and it made it to the top country charts. I mean, it became number one. I can only imagine heaven, what it's going to be like to be with God. Amen. You may be seated. God bless you this morning. Hallelujah.